Well, I had to see it, Divergent. So, Divergent's basically, oh my god, Emma, someone let her in. Uh, Divergent's basically, uh, a movie that's like The Hunger Games, Harry Potter, Twilight, uh, yeah, that's really it. And Lord of the Rings. Like, one of those big series that will have sequels. And is it going to fall under... There's three categories. You can fall under the Lord of the Rings category. The one that I don't like, but is considered the best. Harry Potter, Hunger Games. The one I like. And then Twilight. Yeah. So, I think it goes under the Harry Potter-ish one. Because it's not, like, a... One that won Oscars, but it's one that's, like, good. Like, I never liked any of the Lord of the Rings. So, uh, I saw it last week in theaters. I liked it. It's basically about this girl who was in a society with something called factions. It's, like, post-apocalyptic. And there's five factions. Uh, Abnegation. Uh, Am Amity. Uh, Amy, Candor, Dauntless, Erudite. Erudite is basically like the smart one. Dauntless, the tough, like military. Candor, the honest ones. Abnegation, like the ones that volunteer. Amity, like farmers. Hang on, Dan, do something. So, the movie, and the movie starts off like. She's 16, so it's like her choosing ceremony. It's like her choosing ceremony. So she like chooses fractions. Okay, Emma. She is an abnegation born, but she doesn't want to be an abnegation. So she decides to transfer to Dauntless. Dauntless is like the tough one. And she like does all this military training, fighting. It's it's like very intense and cool. And then at the end there's a big war, like abnegation gets Erudite, like, drugs all the Dauntless to, like, take down Abnegation, because Abnegation runs the government. It's a very cool scene. And there's three books, and they're in the middle of the second one. So I can't wait for the sequels to come out. This is kind of like people with Game of Thrones. Like, everyone watches the series. Well, I don't. My parents do. And a few of my friends do. Uh, everyone watches the series. But, people that have read the books will, like, be able to spoil it. Like, that you read about that teacher who said, If you guys don't sit down and read, I will spoil game out like one spoiler on the board every time you talk. Because I have read all the books. It's kind of like that. So, that's what I want to love. So, I like spoil them for people that annoy me. So, it's a new trend to read them in my grade, read the books. So, overall... It's a good 8 out of 10. It's a good movie. It's probably about as good as Hunger Games Catching Fire. That's a good movie to compare it to. That's my review on uh, Divergent. Oh, and Divergent is like a mix of them. And they try to hunt out the Divergent so they can kill the Divergent because they can like control their fear. So that's my review on